we're trapped on the island by a giant storm. So guess what? Some people make brownies, and then other people hang out in front of the warmest place on the island. The roaring fire has raised the temperature in this building to maybe 55 degrees. Hey, get out of the way, guys. But no, he's okay. This is a live video. Walk right through. We're gonna have questions and... Hey. hey, there we go. So we also have 10 people that were supposed to leave this afternoon and they're still here. So back to the brownies. Sweet brownies. The exciting part. Hello, people. That's my buddy Paul in New Jersey. Hey, Paul. Hey, Paul. Paul, do you want some brownies? All you have to do is come and pick us up. <laughs> it's only blowing 30 plus knots. Hey, sees to call sees six feet know. every five seconds. Hello from Germany. <laughs> All right, Paul wants some brownies. Okay, he Paul. he lives in Manasquan, New Jersey, which is about eight, eight hours away. I'll mail you some. Paul, she'll mail you some. <laughs> They'll get to you in about seven days. Yeah. Once once boat service is resumed, yeah. and then there's a holiday. Your boat could do it. You, Paul, your boat could really go. Hello, Melbourne. Yeah. Oh, Paul, oh, Rich, uh, yeah, Rich, I know where you live. <laughs> Rich, this is where I work. This is our off-season kitchen and off-season dining hall. <laughs> Hello, Kenzie. Can I have the recipe? You love to make it for your family. All right, so here's the recipe. <laughs> show, show us the rep recipe. <laughs> recipe. Recipe. What's it called? Brownie truffle, truffle baking bread. mix. Mm -hmm. Directions and so on and so forth. So if you can find, find brownie truffle baking mix in your grocery store. Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's, there you go, Bob's your <laughs> uncle. You're, all right, hello from Germany, I'm drunk as fuck. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. We have, we have everyone, everyone here is consuming vast quantities of beer. Look at this. Look at all the beer bottles lying. Oh, wait, I think they've already been drunk up. We are trapped here by a storm and there's no beer. So what do you do? You make brownies. So we might need Yes, you would eat all of our food. Our food is really good here. Yeah, Kanzi says, ah, ha, 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 ha. Kanzi, you really like to make brownies? It's, it's really cold and stormy outside. And, and there's no, no, this is the warmest building, and the temperature here is about 55 degrees. Yeah, no, uh, so, Kanzi, you're actually right. Uh, in about three weeks, we're going to have three bakers on duty and they easily go through la large quantities of flour. How many loaves of bread do we make in a year? About 15,000 uh, loaves of bread a year? Probably. And, and by, by a year, I mean June, July, August, September. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's like three and a half months. <coughs> so look at the artistic shaping that's going on here. <laughs> <laughs> Smooth as I silk. Yeah. I hope there's no cannabis. cannabis. No, nope, no, there isn't. No, just chocolate chips. Just chocolate chips. Good. You rated, if, you're, if you're going to do this again, we have some white ones in the bakery. Oh. If you're going to do a second batch or, or it's another night. It's just box. You can sprinkle them on top. There's more, there's, you might want to see what boxes are down there. I think there's a cake mix down there. In the bakery? Yeah. I don't want to go outside. I mean, I'll, I'll bring it up if <laughs> you want it. No, I'm serious. Really? I like to have desserts. Well, we haven't had a dessert yet. Yeah, Alright, so someone is asking, can we do a backflip? Uh, no. Why would we want to do a backflip in the kitchen? So, I love cake too. I wouldn't ask Connor and Chris how they feel curry, about curry sausage loves you. Uh, okay. Katie, so, you have an admirer. Curry sausage loves you. Okay. <laughs> curry sausage, send us your number. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll pass it around. Actually, Somebody will call you. Okay. Yeah, because it's cool to be different. It is cool to be different. Yeah, all right, if you want to see the raging storm, I'll go out to the window. Yeah, poor Kate. Here's the, uh, here's the raging storm. And it really is raging. I'm not, I'm not exaggerating in this instance. This is why no boat is, is, is coming out to our island. Yeah, yeah we're, uh, we're having a northeaster. It's blowing 30 plus knots. It's probably 35 miles an hour. Katie, you are the toughest girl in the in the in the room. This is the person that wants your phone number. 
I think I can block this person if you want me to. <laughs> I, I figure it's just text, so it's it's harmless. <laughs> what the fuck is going on there? Someone can explain. We're making brownies. How hard is that to understand? <laughs> Uh, one thing that happens on this island is we don't have any any real running water yet, so our water supply is out of jugs, and we make uh, make the water out of seawater in our reverse osmosis plant. Oop. Not very deep, huh? So we have a supervisor on scene now, <laughs> making sure everything's just right. Oh no! Johanna will need propane before cooking breakfast. Yes, you can visit. Come on and visit. Just okay, can't visit tonight like, because there's no uh, no boat traffic. It seems like we want it now, but also we have to bring it over anyway. Yeah. Uh, Mindy, I think the water might be online next week. I don't know. We can say something. It has to first uh, be certified yeah. by by the state of New Hampshire, yeah. or maybe the <laughs> town of Rye. Um, it has to be uh, say, like, inspected. Oh, no. Oh, the address is Star Island. Look at the map. It's pretty thin. I know. Don't All of Star right. Island is this this spot. Yeah, don't cook it as long as it's it. So are you serious? The propane just went out? Well, it's the oven isn't heating up, and Johanna said that it was low on propane. So she oh. Said if it does you know, this is up. actually good because we'd have, yeah, we would have found this out at breakfast. Exactly. Yeah. And then it's an emergency. We have to up at 6 in the morning. So I'm Star gonna Island is awesome. If they want to <laughs> do it now in the gross weather or do it in the morning at 6 in the morning, also exactly. <laughs> so I don't know if everyone's been watching, who's watching has been listening, but the stove is not coming on and we've probably run out of propane. Katie, can you say some cute words to me? I'm drunk and I'm feeling lonely. Uh, I don't think that's the way to get someone's attention. And I think you're about to have your last chance. I'm not impressed. Do you mind if I am? You're watching island people. Well, we're not in Eastern Europe. Maybe you are drunk too. We're not in Eastern Europe, we're in Eastern North America. <laughs> oh. Hi, Karen. Hi. Karen, you get to see some pelicans in action. Oh, by the way, yeah, we do have some munchies. Not too many, though. We have some marshmallows. We have some chocolate bits. No, I mean, well, I'm repeating it just for the amusement part, Mindy, but I think Curry's about to become a member of the block list. Well, you're from Eastern Europe, okay. So you're up late. What time is it in Eastern Europe? Add six hours to 7.30, so it's like 1.30 in the morning is one person's watching. So what's the plan? Are you gonna call somebody or? We don't know. <laughs> we don't know. Well, yeah, well, hi. Well, what do you mean there's well, lots of lag? And who, who just came in? Well, here's at least a kitchen person. You can tell us if the stove is, is out of propane. Well, it's not heating up. It's been on Can you tell us if the stove is out of propane? It's not really the actual stove. The actual Actually, you know what? If you try to light the flap top, that will tell us if it's getting any gas. Yeah. That can flash you, so you have to be careful. Um, yeah, Andrew said that sometimes it, uh, it'll act weird when it's not on. I think I hear the, something clicking. <laughs> it is fun living on an island. There's a lot, of, uh, a lot of great people here, and we're only open for about five months during the summer. So this is a small part of the Open Up crew. Well, you know, Karen, we, we haven't given up on the brownies yet. There's still a hope. I mean, they're in the pan, so we're gonna get baked. We're gonna, we're gonna, they're gonna cook sooner or later. They might go into the refrigerator, refrigerator for the night. We need an easy bake oven. Operated by a 100 watt lamp. So, so Paul says put them on top of the wood stove, but Paul, the uh, top of the wood stove has a, a, a layer of insulation and a blower, so you can actually put your hand on top of it. I've only been here for, for a couple days. Who, who's been here the longest? Who came out in like April? Connor. Connor. Connor got out here Yeah, we've here a week after, though. So, you were like first week of May? Mid April. Mid April. Yeah. So it's pretty pretty different yeah, when you're here in April. Okay, I think Curry's lost his chance. 
I wonder what would happen if you put sprinkles on that. Uh, so I look out my window. And I don't want to put sprinkles. On. <laughs> would, they, would they melt? They would probably melt. I'm thinking we should All right. go to Ian's and take it. Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, it's going through Yep. Uh, someone's asking, do we have any hot chicks here? And we do. We have about 24 hot chicks. They're, they're about th two weeks old, and they live in the chicken coop. And maybe I'll show them to you sometime. <laughs> when it's not raining? When it's not raining. When it's not, when it's not a storm. Yeah. Look out the window. We have lots of hot chicks on Star Island. And then they grow up in about three or four weeks. And they're chickens. Look at this. This is a tremendous, tremendous blow. It's a little coffee station. <clears throat> so I think we've run out of action here. We've, we've reached a stopping point because we're stymied. Yeah, it's very windy, Karen. Uh, Karen, we're supposed to uh, go home. People are supposed to go in tomorrow. Put them inside the wood stove, make a Dutch oven. I don't think that's uh, it's a pellet stove. So we could also try to hunt down. Yeah. 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 So unfortunately, the brownies are, are somewhat on hold. So if you want brownies, you'll have to bring us. Uh, we'll have to move uh, the propane line to another tank. Hopefully, the tank it needs is already here. And doesn't have to be and doesn't have to be shifted because that's a pain in the ass. All right, folks, and Karen, Karen, and what? Well, I should be calm. I'm inside. Why not be calm? Look at these people trying to warm up. That pellet stove is blowing hot air, but but once it gets about three feet from the stove, then it's not hot anymore. Is the beer cold? Uh, what beer? There is no beer. It's all, it's mostly been drunk up. It's the end of the week. Oh, I do have a calm voice. Unless I get excited, then I don't have a calm voice. Oh yeah, Karen. So people are supposed to go home tomorrow, but the storm was raging tomorrow, or would be raging, and so we're gonna go home today, and then it was too rough to go home today. Uh, the boat was coming out, and the boat turned around. So, so I'm going to end this video because we've run out of propane and brownies are not immediately forthcoming. Otherwise, we've been enjoying them in a little while. So everybody, thanks for watching. And we thank our Pelican staff for being a good sport, for being on live video. See you, everybody. Good night.